for an out ball. This is Kermit Erasmus. He's been a frequent provider this season. He's looking for Monopoli Saleng. Well, he'll have to be closely watched over the course of this match. Possessing terrifying speed and uh, an improved finishing game. The ball swiftly up the other end. Ashley Dupria goes tumbling down. I'm going to get in that space. If Paris plays a high line, China needs to come off his, his goal line to be able to cut those balls. Just a good ball out from the back. Kevin Erasmus will retrieve this near the corner flag. Marshall by. That's not where Rivero wants to come on. He wants him no. more central because he needs to receive that supply. Now Miguel Tim. Looking to take Once again, the pace of Ashley Dupria causing some problems. And Dupria has played it into the box. Oh! Massive opportunity for Christian Saile. And he has... The change room of Keza Chiefs. Win the ball, play it in the space that Marco has left. Use the pace of Dupree. Then quickly release Saile. That move is perfectly the way Atazwani has planned it. Unlucky, Saile doesn't get to finish. This head, once he sent uh, Dupree to the space that Marco leaves in those wide areas. That's the game plan of Keza Chiefs. Atlantis had to knock this out. 33-year-old from... Newcastle has made 200 appearances in the top flights. Excellent serve and has Monopoli Saleng has an opportunity. He's played it across for Kermit Erasmus. And Orlando Pirates have the lead in the derby. He's the man for the big occasions. BMT, if you're looking for a player with BMT, Kermit Hegel team finding Saleng, explosive speed, getting into that ball. He is behind the ball, therefore he is onside. When that ball comes to Kemi Tirasmas, he's in an onside position. Good awareness from Miguel Tim. I need to play first time. Assist coming from is the other surprise. Is he yet to show us why is the surprise in the starting line? Well, he has an opportunity on the ball now. Dylan Solomon's cutting inside. He's picked out. Yusuf March! Oh! Fizzing efforts! to cut inside, finds Martin's space in between the lines with a weaker foot, goes, it just brushes that upright, a product of the Orlando Paris development team, a man that scored the winner in the first round game, that is Yusuf Martin. Yeah. Yeah. By Dove. Now ball forward for Solomon's uh, diving intervention from Paseca Marco. Paseca Marco has previously appeared in the semi-final of the Netbank Cup, that was for Chippa all the way back in 2017. Oof, really struggling to get the ball clear effectively. You can see something is coming. You can you can sense the danger. You can see Orlando Pirates uh, 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 trying to go on the cover. Marco this time, and just I've already pointed out, has not been fruitful this season for any team. So it is Frosler. Well, he can't get it in because Clamini has uh, raced towards him and blocked that. It begs the question then, was he 10 yards when it was... Uh, Touched by Dupree. Yeah, he took the risk. He took the risk. Solomon's making tracks up the right hand flank, taking on Sibisi. He's got away from him. And hockey, still Solomon's. Lifted over the head of Saile. He's retrieved it, but he's on the right hand side, looking dangerous for Chiefs. Now Orlando Pirates up the other end. Gazana looking to take care of Duka Manja. And he's uh... Saleng. And Marco has got the ball in. Oh, coming around the Ordner. And this time he wants a goal for himself. That's not Saleng's best. Amorapoli Saleng was making a run, anticipating that uh, perhaps Marco would get there first, but Kaiser Chiefs have retreated. Now Ashley Dupria puts it in. Oh, Gezana. He scooped it over. Frostland's face. Sitebe. Solomons. Good cross. Saile. Well, he's had Chiefs' two best chances. To a non-treasure area. Solomon's with that ball to the far post. 
when you're looking at Shandu's defending, he's not open stance. He only sees the ball, he does not see the man. He's just stuck in a toe. Kermit Erasmus. Cut out by Shlanti. He releases Saile. Now Saile, an opportunity to take on Sibisi. Oh, he's flung himself to the ground. Afternoon continues for Saile. He has missed the two of Kizachi's best chances. In this oh. instance, Sibisi needs to do better. Fukumanja. Lovely little disguise ball for Marco. Now it's a cross into a dangerous area. It's retrieved on the far side here by Dion Hotto. A deflected cross repelled by Ed Milson. Gezana and Reef Frosler conspire to lose that. Fukumanja. Erasmus. Kermit Erasmus takes aim. Oh, he's rising. In that distance, seeing Peterson off the line and trying his luck. Unlucky not to get it on target. Looking to exploit the pace of Ashley Dupria once again. We've seen uh, this season. How does Frostlu takes fingertips on that from China? Collected by Zwane. As a 10. And Salem will rove around behind Zugama. Area via his head. It falls here for Solomon. Just possessed by Monare, but Chiefs regain possession. That's a great ball. And instead of going for goal, Fourth quarter for Orlando Pirates. Here's Dupria. Takes it down neatly. Ashley Dupria. Took an edge from Inglondlo. He will get the free kick in his face. In the league this term. Now refrost this ball towards the near post. Again, another opportunity to cross. He's lifted in with his left. Oh! Over from Flanty. For. Another player who's emerged recently from the development. Number eight, um, more quicker, more creative, that is um, Dusha Malala. He came on in the quarterfinals and created a goal for Keza Chiefs. We'll come back to that. That's a lovely ball for Terence Fukumanja. He's tracked by Edmilson Dobe. And now Dion Hotto with a wild effort. Fernandez, who was a hero in the shootout, with messages being passed from Baron to Kuni. Supply will to play. Or Solomon be the man to give him the supply that he needs. It is one goal in 2023, and that did come in the the Nedbank Cup as Dylan Solomon keeps this alive, forcing a tackle out of Toki. Sibisi does well, back with Lanti. A clever ball for Dupria, Ashley Dupria. No Saling. And Londla. Torian Paz cross field for Glamini. Still Glamini. This is Saleng. And Saleng! He's lashed a shot from a tight angle towards goal. Yeah, Glamini delays, delays to wait for him to get into position. He releases him. He lets the ball run across him. Now Solomon to Marx. He's rolled it in. Parity for Kaiser Chiefs. Stadium has gone wild. In all competition for Yusuf Mart, he says the goal is correcting him. This in, um, um, may, um, the amount of space he's in. Tim doesn't track him. Munari doesn't track him. But look at Solomon. Solomon, he cuts inside. Look at that well weighted pass. No one is tracking him. Marco tries to go on that cover. A well taken goal. A midfielder's goal, a captain's goal. He makes the run into, into that area. Orlando Pirates found one thing in that midfield. A lovely goal scored by Yusuf Mart. The twig in midfield for Atazano. Taking the risk now of committing moment for Martin Tosano. Now Mart had another opportunity potentially. Back on turns. Here's Trukamanja. This cross had far too much on it. Melen Kune in the absence of a Tony Munari checks out like for like in terms of Mark. Oh, he's forced his way through here as Hotto Saleng on the turn. Tobe Thornton Makaula. Oh, watch.
Energy to burn, couldn't keep the ball in on the uh, the near side as Dylan Solomon says, hold back here. And... He was gone. Yeah. In terms of, uh, of a race between Teto and Solomon, he's going to win it all day. He's going to win it all day. Um, Miss Times is tackling that moment. He sells himself out. For the first season, he's had uh, of the CBC for Orlando Pirates. Now kept in. Salim scoops it to Evan Gah! Defense. Monopoly Saling with the ball in. There's a foot from Frostler to get it clear now in Glonglo. Saling. The cross. Oof. A few instances and penalties for Pirates against Dondosaurus as Pimini Minor looks to link up. And Sabisi takes care of that as Dupria tries to work some space. And still Paseca Marco continues on. A wonderful tackle from Sitebe. I'm stressed. And the fact that he's stressed, I feel teams have, have given away so much possession when they didn't have to. They keep having lost a semi-final. Hasn't to Shavalada. Thwarted by Sabisi who gets the ball stuck under his feet. So it is Tatela Poki. Dove and uh, Chupulu Novo. 2020 21 uh, defender of the season, keeping goal or keeping. Uh, now tossed back into play for the Burundian. They won't get it clear. The time that they learned they'd be taking on Mamelodi Sundowns. In the MTN8 semi-final, they only picked up uh, nine of 18 available points. Doing some defensive work, gets his head on the ball. Now Sitebe, three successive tackles from Sitebe. Sitebe, oh, it's it's uh, an absolute melee out there. This is what it is. Solomon's, Makaula. Hmm. 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 Eight away games, that was that game to Chiefs as Bimini Mana picks it up. Now he's trying to turn it infield with a flick of his boots. My fall here for Solomons. Ashley Dupria. Still Dupria. Oh, Gazana have to scramble back. Dion Otto looking to latch on to that ball. Bit of a misheader. It's fallen for the Namibian Dion Hotto through the legs of Frostler. Here's in Glondlo. Being tracked by Shabalala. Still in Glondlo. And now Makaula. Desperate defending from Kaiser Chiefs as they get it clear. Saleng. Tim. Evanga. And it's headed from Frostler. Sabisi takes care of the danger as well. It's been feathered through for Evan Gar by Monopoly Salem. Clever little header off the top. A big opportunity for Orlando Pirates. Salem takes. Glondlo hoists it back into the danger area. Oh! Orlando Pirates! Deep into extra time have come up. With a huge moment and the towering centre half, who was brought on as a sub, has got the touch. He's one of the players that was not picked up. Chiefs deal with the first phase of defending. He turns in Zonzo, he looks out. Now, look who's supposed to be tracking him. It's Dove. It's Dove. He's between Dove and Santi. None of them pick him up. Their jackknife technique puts it in the back of the net and assists by Zonzo. Two players that are coming off the bench combine to win to, to get it. So they've re-established their lead. Have the Buccaneers five or so minutes to they say this, this is payback time in Tetra. It's an old goal from Inda. 
Well, Kaiser Chiefs to grab victory in the second, and it looks like Pirates are going to keep up their trend of having never been involved in a penalty shootout in an Bank Cup semi-final. Remember, they have never previously lost an Bank Cup semi-final in the PSL era of their bitterest of rivals. Again, by the narrowest of margins, as Mart tries to shoulder that hero mantle and score.